Hey everybody, let's get started with using SketchUp and saving it to a desired location so we know where to find it later. Okay, the first thing you want to do is open SketchUp by signing into your Google account. Um, ours in our district is a Google suite, so we would open our Google Drive. And here it is after you sign in with your username and password, you get to your drive. When you see these nine little black dots, this some people call it the waffle. These are your Google apps right here. And in these, if you scroll all the way down, I'm rolling my zoom dial down, you'll see all of the stuff that you're enabled, allowed to use. And here at the bottom, SketchUp for schools. So when you click on that, it opens this. Eventually. <laughs> Uh, yep. Let's go. Here it comes. One of these days. All right. So you'll get to this page where it's ready to open SketchUp or something like this. I have a lot of files. Maybe you just have a blank page that says create new or take tutorials, take a tour. I want you to create new. When you create a new file, It'll automatically open this blank file of this avatar, this person's here, just to give you a sense of scale, like what's about six feet or five feet. And green grass, blue sky, great. It says untitled. The first thing I want you to do is to click on that, and that's a way you can rename the name of the file. So go to My Drive, select this is where you want to save it to. I want to save it to My Drive. And now, you can choose what folder you want to put it into. And if you don't have a folder you're putting your files into for your teacher, and you can always click this plus new folder symbol and you can create a new folder. And you can call this for the sake of a lot of these tutorials after this, I think I said like um, SketchUp files. Something like that. And create. And it will automatically make that folder for you. And in that folder, since it's highlighted blue, you know you're going in there, you can rename your file. You can rename it um, anything you want, really. I'm just going to say my first SketchUp file. Um, and when you do that, you hit save here. You're going to save this file to that location. There. You see the title changed, my first SketchUp file. Something you need to know for future tutorials about this, I recorded a lot of these a couple of years ago during the pandemic, and they changed, SketchUp changed this toolbar a bit. Uh, it used to be subsets in here. Everything involving lines used to be under this pencil icon. Everything involving shapes used to be under this rectangle. Now, to get to all the other features, instead of just a rectangle, if you wanted to do like a circle or another shape, you have to come to these three dots, click on that, and it opens a window with all of those similar functions in the same area, like lines, arcs, curved lines, polygons, shapes, and like that. So just remember, if you don't see something that I'm talking about in your current toolbar, go to these three dots and it'll open that window. All right, see you for the next tutorial.